I'm Courtney Courtright. And I'm Erin Jenkins. We here at WNCT want to wish you a happy Independence Day. Tonight's festivities kicked off in Uptown Greenville at the Town Common. The community came out to enjoy a car show, live music, plenty of food vendors, and so much more. Yes, not in your size. Erin J. Uh, excuse me, Adriana Hargos. Erin, you're right here. Who is there <laughs> this okay. evening? She joins us now from the Town Common, where fireworks just wrapped up. Adriana, this heat just getting to me. How big of a day was it for Greenville? Courtney and Aaron, despite the hot weather, everyone out here wasn't letting them stop him from celebrating the 4th of July festivities. And what better way to end the 4th of July festivities uh, with a fireworks show? We're having a good time. People at Town Commons say they're enjoying what today's celebrations have to offer, including showing off some cars in the classic car cruise. But to come down here on the 4th of July, there'll be a lot of people here. They'll be asking a lot of questions. There's people who have never seen a car like this before or a car like Robert's because they're young. You know, they're not old like us guys. <laughs> <laughs> but not only did they come for the car show, they also wanted to share the real reason behind Independence Day and how special it means to them. Well, I've got three uncles who were in World War II, and two of them did not make it back. One did. And I had a father that worked in the machine of airplane parts during World War II. So Fourth of July is very important me and our family. Well, I had two brothers as well that served in the military along with myself and um, we, uh, we love our country and we love celebrating our country. One vendor came all the way to Greenville from Goldsboro. Hey, super excited, super excited. This is what we do. We love serving the communities. And speaking of serving, Man, woo, we got ribs, pork chops, we got um, fried gator, we got wings. We got hot dogs, we got hamburgers, we got uh, crab legs, it's just, you name it. And you can't forget about the patriotic spirit. Some decked out in dazzling jewelry and their red, white, and blue. Very patriotic. Uh, no, yeah, I mean, it's, it's a good time to get out and be able to celebrate the freedoms that not a lot of people do get to get. Um, and just, yeah, just go ahead and have a good time and be able to en enjoy all them freedoms. Now, officials are always reminding you if and when you're leaving any 4th of July event, be safe and don't drink and drive. Live in Greenville, Adriana Hargrove, 9 on your side.